Hello and welcome to another episode of the Poseidon God of Water 20 show. The Spooktastic Halloween still continues in series 30, episode 7, making it episode making it episode 1204. Overall, now have you ever wondered what it'd be like if a book from the uh, if the book of the devil ever ended up in your hands? Well, check this story out. It's called the Devil's Book. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> oh, sorry, mate. I forgot you were here. What's that you're reading? Oh, it, it's um, it's this book I found at the old, yeah, uh, a flea market. Looks in good condition. Yeah, pretty good condition for what's supposed to be a cursed book. Is that the name of the title? Uh, no, the title is Evercross, the new Kiss by an Angel novel. Yeah, so what's this cursed book, Malarkey? Well, there's, there's a legend behind this book that says if you read just one page, you'll be cursed with bad luck. But I've now read 103 pages. <laughs> and I don't feel cursed. No, you're looking fine to me. Up to chapter 10. So much for a cursed book. Whoa! What's going on? I was just trying to put this book down and it suddenly flew out of my hand. I'm so scaring myself. Oh dear. <laughs> it doesn't appear to be anything remotely cursed about that book. Such a heavenly title. So much for a cursed book. One page cursed. You've read like a hundred pages. And nothing's happened. You're more yeah. than just cursed. I don't believe that whole cursed book nonsense for a second. It's just an old legend. It's a perfectly ordinary. Ah. Mate? What's going on? What? First the book flies out of my hand, then I slip on the seat. <laughs> and that's all from just touching the book. You're becoming a bit clumsy. Uh. Why are the legends true? No. And what will happen if I just held the book? I bet nothing will happen. Right. I'll try it. See? As bright as rain. Uh, 
what you put in his face is. Uh, uh, I'm not so sure you're supposed to be trying to eat the book. What's happening, mate? Uh, Hello. Oh, you have me worry there. What is going on with that book? I'm starting to believe the curse. One page in your curse, I've read 103. Which means you're totally fucked. Well, nice knowing you, mate. Hey, <laughs> get away from me, you damn book. <sighs> Maybe you should take it back to that flea market. I can't. They said once I pay for the book, I can't return it. How much did you pay for that thing? <sighs> Some flea market that was. They charged me 500 quid for it. You you paid 500 quid for a book? <laughs> Our flea market. You've been at it. <sighs> It's an innocent book to me. Was that Sonny? Who? Huh? <laughs> you appear to be very old. <laughs> Was that Sonny? I can't hear you. I said you appear to be very old. <laughs> oh. <sighs> what the hell happened then? I don't know. This book should be in a museum. The book should be on a fire. that noise? What's happening? <sighs> You're looking drained mate. <sighs> I don't know what it is, but that book, Kissed by an Angel, Ever crossed. More like ever cursed. Scammed by the dead. The uh, what the hell? <laughs> um that book just attack you. Book? What book? That book. I don't remember no book. Th the curse book. Curse book? <laughs> I don't you... remember no curse book. You want to check your wallet? You're 500 quid down. What wallet? What? The one you keep in your trouser pocket. What trouser pocket? <laughs> the one on your clothes. What clothes? The ones you're wearing. Who are you? <laughs> me? You don't remember me? Uh, who am I? You're Percy. Who's Percy? Huh? <laughs> I think we need to go down to the hospital right away, mate. What hospital? What's going on? <laughs> this is some freaky crap. What am I doing down here? You said you got attacked by a book. And then you lost all your memory. First a book jumps out of my hands. Then it makes me slip in my seat. 
Then it makes me have some kind of weird spasm. Then it hits me in the head, turning me into an amnesiac. Not to mention turning me into an old man temporarily. Book! What do you think you're... Ugh. Up to? Ugh. Wish I hadn't bought that damn book. I wish you hadn't bought that damn book. Uh. What the? Are you okay? Are you okay? <gasps> <laughs> and there you have it. That's what would happen if the book of the devil ended up in your hands. It would possess you bit by bit until you're completely taken over. That's it for this episode. Well, join us next time as we present to you a cautionary tale called Don't Read Those Messages. Until then, bye-bye.